Kaipaki School is a little, a little country school situated in between Ohopo and Cambridge and it's such an awesome place. It's got a really great vibe around it where all the students know each other. So right now I'm going to sit down with a few of the seniors and see what it's like to be a senior here at Kaipaki. Well now I'm sitting down with the senior seniors of Kaipaki School and there's only a few of them which is pretty awesome. So I'll get their names first. What's your name? Desi. Penny. River. Brody. Ronnie. Caleb. Awesome. And you Rowan. Rowan. Cool. Nice to meet you guys. Now there's only like what maybe six-ish of you guys and how like what years are included in senior seniors really? Um about six to eight. Yep. Cool. And so that's how many students like how many senior students you've got? How many students do you have in total? Um in the school we have about 49. Yeah. All right, so it's quite a small school, even though it's so close to Cambridge as well. Now, have you come to this school your whole school life? No. Where were you before that? Leamington. Oh, sweet. Awesome. We love Leamington School. We've visited there quite a lot on Mishmash TV. What about you guys? Have you come to Kaipaki, like, your whole life? Um, yeah. Yeah, you have? What's that like? What's it like coming to, like, quite a small school for your whole life? It was very easy to make friends. Yeah, definitely. So do you know everyone really well now? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> that would be like the best thing about it. What about you, Jizzy? Have you come here the whole time? Um, no, my first school was Leamington School as well. Oh, cool. So did you did you know Ronnie at school as well? Yeah, he's my brother. Oh, well, obviously you knew each other then. Hey, there we go. We're finding out about family relationships here. Um, and so are there many, like, brothers and sisters that come to this school? Um, we've got three people of our family right here and we've got yeah. one more coming. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Oh, very cool. So will, will everyone be at school at the same time? Um, no, Ronnie won't be here. Yeah. But I'll be here for like half a year. Yeah, that, that would have been quite cool, eh? So now with these guys, the senior seniors, because they've been at school for quite a while, they end up becoming the leaders of the school, which is pretty awesome. So what what kind of leadership stuff do you guys end up doing, Ronnie? Oh, uh, we get to run games like we do mini tabloid games and all that sort of stuff yeah. and we get to help run sausage sizzles yeah and all that sort of stuff I hear that happened recently so what did you guys have to do for that oh we have to get sausages out and we have to take all the orders and we cook a certain amount of sausages for the people in the school yeah and were you guys like fundraising for something yeah we're fundraising for our end of year seven and eight trip to Wellington and what are you going to get up to in Wellington? We're not sure yet. And I hear that you guys own your own school bus as well. So who here is, are the bus monitors? You guys, yeah? So what, what happens, so pretty much all you seniors, <laughs> since you're all awesome leaders, what happens um, with, like, what is a bus monitor? What do you guys have to do? Um, we have to control people the way we want them to um, <laughs> behave on the bus. I love that. Sounds a little mm. bit manipulative. No. Mm. <laughs> so it's just trying to keep like the younger kids quiet and stuff like that. Yeah. So you're almost being a teacher, eh? Mm. <laughs> yeah, so how do you find how do you find they are usually on the bus? Does it get a bit rowdy sometimes? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, who are like some of the naughty the naughty ones? What are the naughty things they do on the bus? Um kicks, but punch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen some crazy stuff happen on the bus? Um some people walk up and down when there's no bus monitors on the bus so yeah. So they have to wait they have to wait for you guys to get on the bus? Yeah. Yeah. So as a bus monitor then, how does it work like getting on the bus in the morning? I'll ask you Ronnie, like do you have to be on there first or do they just pick you up and then you take charge? You have to be one of the first people on the bus to be a bus warden. Yeah. And like for the people that get off last in the afternoon, they're a bus warden and they are a bus warden when they get on in the morning as well. Oh sweet. So do you have to be a year seven or a year eight to be a bus warden? Pretty much. Yeah. Year sixes are allowed sometimes if they're like the very last person off. Yeah. And I hear you guys have like a special uniform for that as well. What is it? Do you guys have to wear something in particular or a badge or something to say you're a bus warden? Just an orange high-vis jacket. Mean! <laughs> so cool. So you can be spotted very easily. Oh, I love that. And now you guys, final question. Why do you guys like coming along to Kaipaki School? I like coming along because it's like such a small school and you get to know kids really easily and like it's a fun school. Yeah. Yeah, and for you, Desi, what do you think you'd want to do in the future, like when when you're nice and old? <laughs> um, I want to be a chef 
and uh, athlete. Oh, both of them. Wow, that would be pretty amazing if you could, like, I don't know, cook something while running a track, something like that. <laughs> what about you, Brody? What would you like to do when you're older? Um, hard question. I don't yeah, really know. not sure. But what is your favourite thing about Kaipaki School then? Um, that you experience different things. Yeah. Like you don't have exactly the same things as old schools do. So. Yeah, totally. And you guys all like work together really well. Do you think like all the juniors and middles and seniors all all get along pretty well? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty well, as as well as people can get along, I guess. And what about you, Ronnie? What would you like to do when you leave school? Uh, I want to join the Navy and get my boat ticket so I can drive big boats. Man, that sounds wicked. And from your experience of being at Kaipaki, what's the best thing about it? Um, Probably being able to know everybody. Yeah. Get to know everybody really well. Yeah. And you're like, you get to stand out as well, which is the cool thing about you seniors, eh? Like getting to do all these leadership things. Great, well thank you all so much for chatting to me and telling me a bit about your school. It's been so cool to meet you guys and to find out a little bit about your bus and all your leadership stuff. Thanks, thanks.